Okay, this is just a bit of a follow-up video on an idea I had. Uh, I'm entertaining the thought or the idea of fixing this door. A um, couple hundred bucks to buy a new one, custom order. Uh, and really the door is in good shape except for this damage. Um, it was pushed in and you can guess what had happened. A young fella years ago venting, it happens. Um, anyway. What I'd done basically is I just took the Dremel and basically cut any of the material that was uh, pushed out, damaged, cut it all the way through here with this blade, inch and a quarter, little wood saw blade. And uh, just to allow it to be able to pull back up. And then I'd taken some two inch uh, uh, deck screws, ground the ends off, and then drilled a small pilot hole So what this does actually, it acts like a jacking bolt. It's going to bottom out on the other side. Right there it's bottoming out and you can see it's pulling it up. And you can hear it. And it actually worked really well. Um, for this whole joint. <clears throat> that might be a little bit too far. Back. that one off just a bit. So you get the idea. It pulled all that back out quite nicely. I'm going to take some carpenter's glue and uh, glue all these joints. Let that set up. I'll sand it and then use drywall mud. Uh, sand it out or uh, apply it of course and then sand it out. Then you might have to etch a little bit of that, uh, bit of that wood grain in there. Uh, prime it a couple times and I think it should be uh, good as new and yeah, a couple hundred bucks uh, used for something else. Invest in more tools, who knows. I'll uh, follow up uh, as it progresses.